Hey, what's up? It's your boy A to the K to the K, Alexander King Kwame, and welcome to Hoodie Studios. So today we are going to talk about an amazing app called the Meta Tailor app. Now, this app can help you clothe all your meta human characters and send them into Unreal Engine. And it's not only about your meta human characters, also any custom character that you have that you want to clothe them and send it in, send them into Unreal Engine. You can easily do that with the Meta Tailor app. So I will not waste much of your time. Let's just dive into it and all the links are in the description so let's keep rolling to get to the meta tailor up all we have to do is we just have to go to bridge to get any meta human that you need so I just choose this one here and I will bring it into our scene so let me take off the sphere and for the location I will make sure it's zero 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 okay so there we have our meta human now for you for things to be so easy for you I made my cloth with the meta human so that will make things really easy for you okay so in marvelous designer I made my cloth with the meta human with the meta human character so i did the clothing with the meta human character so you can also do that which will also speed the workflow for you so i'll go to file and i'll say export selected and i'll just um name it meta and i'll just save it okay so export Okay, so let's jump right into the Meta Tailor app. We are inside the Meta Tailor app and inside the Meta Tailor app, all I'm gonna do is just create a new project. So I'll just click on that and loading project. So boom, we have this here and I'm using the early access. Yeah, we have this here. So all we have to do is we will go to import and we will go to avatar and we are gonna load in the meta human avatar so i will double click this is our meta human avatar so we will not do much here i will just say next at this point we have these landmarks on our meta human character so you can actually say auto map if you mess this up you can go to auto map and it will just do the app will do the best to auto map everything okay so at this point i think everything is cool so i can just say next step then we can now choose an avatar the meta human avatar all right so for this tutorial, I'm actually going to use um, my own designs, a basketball design for the Meta Human. I, again, I said I made a clothing with the Meta Human avatar in Marvelous Designer. So I won't have to do much of stuff here. I just have to bring them in and I'll just give it to our Meta Human avatar. So to do that, you will have to go to import and cloth slash accessories i'll click that and i'll go for the top so this is my um my fbx so i have a top and i have a down which is the design which is the basketball top and the basketball down i'll click i'll first go for the top and yeah so this is it and all i'll do is i'll just go to next step and I will have to specify here is it gloves hair head jacket or shirt pants so this one I'm gonna choose shirt okay then I would say next step and do I want to move it do I want to scale it then I don't want to do anything so I'll just say next step and voila we have it on a meta human so cool with this method we are actually escaping 
a lot of process where you have to match your pose to your cloth you understand that is why i made the clothing with the meta human avatar in the marvelous designer app we will go to import i'll say cloth slash accessories i'll say down and i'll go i'll say next step and i'll go i'll make a pants and it's, it's looking really big so i'll say next step and i'll try and scale it down a little bit so just like this and i'll try and uh move it so i can know it's really gonna fit well let me check okay so like this so after you are done you just hit confirm and you can see next step and boom there we have it and don't forget you have a lot of options even after when you are done importing it onto your avatar and you want to scale you can come back and you can scale you can rotate you can move you have all your brushes here and you can also do the layering so actually maybe this one i want this one to be tagged in maybe it's actually out and i wanted to tack it in i'll just say tack in and it will just be inside this one and that's what we want and actually i want to bring down the scale of this one a little bit so i can say scale something like this and i'll say confirm when you check and everything is all good everything is all cool then you can export that into a real engine so then you go to export and you give a folder name name it how whatever you want to name it so i'm gonna name it like meta and i like it as fbf texture format png uh okay i don't like the um avatar i like the skin weight okay then i'll choose a save location and i will export so let's jump into unreal engine we are into unreal and we will have to import our cloth from meta tailor app so i already have a meta tailor folder i will double click and um i will bring in the meta tailor export so this is it and i will drag it into here and for the skeleton we will have to go in for the meta human base skeleton now if you have any meta human skeleton make sure you are actually selecting the right one so I'm selecting this one so I, I only have only one so I'm selecting better human base skeleton so I'll select it I'll just say import all we have it we have all of them in here and um, so this is the skeletal mesh and this is the physics asset now how do we get it onto our meta human it's pretty simple I will go to I'll just go to under the meta human folder i will go to the name of the meta human and i will double click and which will bring you the blueprint and i will select the torso and under the skeletal mesh asset i'm actually gonna bring in the cloth asset which is the oh i actually name it meat sorry so uh yep this is it and i'll just say compile and i'll save and i'll go back and when i go back we have it in here after this and i'm actually not feeling the textures the color of the textures but that's not a problem all you have to do is uh, you can uh, i already have my textures from a meta human I'm sorry, my textures from Marvelous Designer into uh, uh, Unreal Engine. So what I would do is I would go to the Meta Tailor app and I can just bring up um, any any of the textures. Uh, I will double click it and I will just go to and I'll bring in this texture and I'll pump it into the base color. 
I'll just say apply. So I'll bring in this one and I'll just pump it into the base color and I'll just say apply. And that was this here. So I can actually um, put this in so you can see uh, the before and after. So you can see that one here and when I push this one in and I'll click apply, you can see it, it's now um, giving us the better textures. So I'll actually pump in all the textures and we will move to the animation. To play some of the animations, I will click on uh, MetaHuman and I'll go to Buddy. And under animation mode, I will set it to use animation asset. So in animation asset, I will go in for this one. And I'll bring it in here. So um, let's play it and see. I'll actually say um, simulation. Okay, everything is working pretty cool ah nice so that was about the animation now to get the meta tailor up you have to jump into their website so let me just show you this is the Meta Tailor website and you can get early access. So when you click on early access, you will get into the uh, Discord channel, which is also down here. Uh, yeah, join our community, which is also down here for the Discord and their YouTube channel. And you can contact them for the pricing. There's a free version and there's a pro plan. So go in for what will best fit your need. And I'm checking some of the features here. They have dynamic accessories, uh, which is super cool. And they have full adjustability. But they, bro, they have a lot of tools in this Meta Tailor app, which is going to help a lot of users in Unreal Engine. So, yeah, go check it, the Meta Tailor app out. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace out. I'm out.